Right, hello, and today we are playing Fable 3. This is one of the many escort missions, or quests called In Morning. I have to escort this lady to, uh, to her husband's grave, and we are fighting Hollow Men. Ooh, my step uncle's on that. I think it's my step uncle, or it's my mate, or my stepdad. I don't know. Right, oh, there's your one. Right, so this is a really good RPG. Um, there's my mate James. Um, yeah, this is a really good RPG. I enjoyed Fable 2. Uh, what do you think of it, Joe? I think it looks significantly better than Fable 2. It looks less cartoony, a bit yeah, more gothic, actually. I like it. Oh, it might just be this area. Yeah, but... this is um, Morningwood, I think. Something like that. Something real, I think. Say, like, don't come out of this area at night. And uh, cause a bunch of hollow men show up as it was just then. As in random. No doggy, I don't want to use a do Oh, fuck, I might as well. I shall never love again. Not like I love Why did he have to be a soldier? Go. Oh. Okay. So, digging then you dick. Does your dog change the more, like, good or bad you are in this one? Yeah. So what does it turn into if you get do bad? I don't know, I didn't look it up. I think it's like a red-eyed Doberman like in Fable 2. Oh, cool. And it'll be like a golden retriever for good or something like that, won't it? Oh, I'll stay as it is. Ah, fair enough. Uh, I've got another quest on the go, but I don't have enough money for it. It's to it's called Marriage for Marriage Made in, in, in made Inconvenience. In inconvenience. To break up a marriage by seducing the uh, wife, what the heck's that? and I have to, I've asked her to marry me, but I need she won't, she's a right bitch, and she won't say yes until she actually, actually get a house. Yeah. Yeah, I really enjoy the combat of this game. I gen gave this game a really good, really low score actually. Yeah. Well, well, it isn't the best and more creative RPGs. Yeah. I mean, it has got really nice clothing aspects and the whole good and evil thing. Yeah. But the fact that like one button is to shoot, one button's just to attack, and one's for something completely spell. different, magic. Yeah. It's just, oh, well, I want to cast a spell, I'll press B. I want to shoot something, I'll press Y. Yeah. You know, it is a bit boring when it comes down to actual fighting. You can't really be creative. Digging up a grave. Besides yeah. that, I think it, graphics-wise and plot-wise and all the other va variants are actually quite good. I think that's the only aspect where it takes away. Yeah. I mean, I'm real psyched about Oblivion. Oh, Skyrim. I mean, it looks amazing. I finally looked at um, the videos for it. I know. Holy and the crap. fact that it looks very Viking based as well, which yeah, looks amazing. Yeah, I say, Joe, you complain and say like if it's two handed long swords. It would be the real Asian Japanese, but. That. My combat to that is, is Vikings. Cause which cause, makes sense. Because it is in the realm of the Nords where I suppose I can let it slide. Yeah, yeah Joe's really for. Holy fuck, these are a lot of hollow men. I'm trying for the never get knocked down achievement, so I have to avoid and shoot. I'm using the level 3 hero sword and I can't remember what this gun's called, I'm going to have to look it up later before I put up the video. Yeah, and, I've made, and I'm using a com two combined spells of shock and uh, flames. I used to like the wind spells in the second one. Yeah. Yeah, this game is always based on humour and it has got some funny quests in it. Like once I had to cross dress in an earlier quest in an earlier quest to to finish this ghost's play. Don't lie, I bet you just cr cross dressed and sat there playing the game. I, I bet it was the other way around. <laughs> Fuck off, Joe. Just wearing your mum's panties going, ha I shall suit things on this game. In my mum's clothing. Meh. Meh. Why would, I be, why would I do an evil laugh if I'm in my mum's pants? Because you got caught and you, you didn't want to go to a psychiatric ward so you pretend you was evil? I think I'd go to a psychiatric ward more if I was doing an evil laugh. Yeah. 
Alright, I've got the achievement for 500 melee kills, I'm just going to go for the spells and the gun. Saying that, that's what I used to do, but I used to have a blunderbuss. Yeah, I prefer rifles. Yeah. I see rifles as more range thing than myself. That's why I'm trying to stay back. Yeah. Thing is, with blunderbusses, you just let you go, come on, come on, come closer, and then blow them up completely. You have to kill that big guy, otherwise, and they keep summoning the ship. Bro. Well, Good thing my dog's immortal. Shame there isn't like a lock on system. Oh, no, there is. No, but I mean, like, do you know while you're rolling around? Ah, uh, I see what you mean. So you could just pick out the big guy and just keep shooting at him. Say that, it would make it a bit too easy. Fine. But yeah, oh, when it comes down to Skyrim, it's bound to be an amazing game. Yeah, I'm going to buy it the day it comes out. I will scrounge money <laughs> and I will lose six months of my life. Oh, die, you fat bastard. How many minutes are we on, Joe? Yeah, about six. About six. I'm, I hope I can get to the, I hope I get to the grave in town. Make a run, run, woman, run! Take my fucking hand already, woman. There we go. I'm trying to be nice to you. Okay, there we go. Dum, 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 dum. Please. I expected more Holloman. And I got five, five guild seals with this I can spend on upgrades. Money. Alright, how many minutes are we in? Seven. Seven minutes. I might as well go show off my sanctum and my weapons and armour. Weapons. I have got the in melee, I've got the bloodstone bludgeon. The hero hammer, which you start with. And the hero sword. As of guns, I'll find out what that gun's called now. The bone smasher is a strong pistol. The gust gets musky, that's what I'm using at the moment. The hero rifle and the hero pistol. And by the way, spells, I have the. Uh, are these ones you've bought and just put on display then, or...? No, these are ones I've found and I can only choose two at a time. I've got the Fireball, the Shock, the Ice Storm, the Vortex, and the Force Push. Those two do complement each other. Now, how many minutes, Joe? So, um, eight. Eight, right, I can show off my costumes. I've got the men's mercenary suits. Um, I don't, I've got an incomplete military suit. I've got a Dweller's Men's suit, the Men's Masquerade suit, I'm using the shirt for it, I'm using the Practical Prince's pants, I've got the uh, military gloves and the mercenary boots on and the mercenary beard and mercenary tattoos all over my body, you can't see it because I'm wearing clothes. The Practical Prince suit, a chicken suit, <laughs> my pyjamas, uh, un an incomplete Yule, Yule time costume. And a Bowerstone Soldier uniform. Right, so that was the in morning quest and showing off my shit. Alright, that was Fable 3. Thank you, see you in my next bit.